Okay. So let's talk about the play and the importance of the uh, character and also the important character. Then we shall see the introduction of the characters. Here the play, that is the final solution. It spans the period from the partition to the end of the 20th century and examines the attitudes of three generations of middle classes, Gujarati business family. The play is about one of the middle class orthodox Gujarati business family, okay? And it uh, examines the attitudes of three generations, grandmother, her son, and uh, his wife, after that, their children or her, their child. Okay, so we will. I will explain you uh, who comes in the first generation, second generation, and third generation. Okay, so here the play as it gets started. Uh, okay, it was at the end of the twentieth century. Okay, the partition to the end of the twentieth century. Okay, what are the things taking place in India? The play talks about such sensitive things. And the things were uh, spoken by the characters, which were made by Mahesh Tattani from his work. And here are the characters. The first and the old age character is Harvika. Okay, she represents first generation. Harvika's earlier name is Daksha, and she gets married with the person called Hari. So in order to match her name with him, her in-laws, means Hari's parents, changes Daksha's name and they keep her name as Harvika. Harvika and Hari, they together blessed with a son and his name is Ramnik Gandhi, okay? Harvika's in-laws surname is Gandhi, okay? Gandhi family. Uh, they don't have any relation with or they are not the relatives of Mahatma Gandhi. Just for the sake, okay, uh, they have surname as Gandhi, okay. So, Ramnik Gandhi, he is the son of Harvika and he belongs to the second generation. He got married with the lady called Aruna, okay, and she is the most orthodox lady. Then, okay, Ramnik and Aruna. Ramnik and Aruna, okay, Ramnik who is the son of Hari uh, and uh, Harvika or Daksha and Harvika got married with Aruna, okay, and the couple that is Ramnik and Aruna, together they have blessed with a child called Smita, a daughter called Smita, okay, Smita, the daughter of Ramnik and Aruna, she belongs to third generation. Smita, as a college-going girl, she has a very liberal, idealistic character and she is very broad in her visions, okay? She is very straightforward. In the college, she has two friends, that is Babban and Tasneem, okay? Babban and Tasneem. So, Tasneem's brother is Javed and Babban and Javed are very good friends. In the earlier times, Smita and Babbun, okay, Smita and Babbun were in love, but Smita and Babbun together, they made a conclusion that because they both belonging to the two opposite communities, so society will never uh, leave them to be happy, okay, to have a happy full life. They both never revealed this world in the play, but Smita at some extent, okay, when we sensibly think about her character, she herself, okay, she comes away, she keeps the full stop to the relationship. That is Tasmi. So this is a very small introduction of each of the characters. And we shall study the acts in detail. And later again, once again, when you study the acts in detail, you will be introduced with each of the characters minutely and very clearly.